And he'll make the pass in traffic. West hands to George. The All-Star fires and hits. So Paul George, who uh, average night game six, where the Wizards trail the Patriots by four. That's a nice name out of the pass that your Todd can hook up with. Moses. <laughs> <laughs> Moses with the league MVP and the playoff MVP in 1983. Exactly the Philadelphia right. Sixers. Back in this thing, Mike. Hey, Doris, offensively, you did game three with Mark Jones. Does it feel like the offensive struggles they had in that game here? Both in terms of missed shots and bad body language in the immediate aftermath of that, Mike. And it feels like they're playing like they're stuck in mud like Indiana did last game. Yeah, great point. Those were the words used by Frank Vogel, Paul George. And they got, I'm giving them an excuse here. Yeah, yeah. Right I, I don't think the CEO of the majority partner <laughs> wants any bit of that. Three point game, five ten to go. George, oh, nice job inside that penetration, and then they just forgot about it. And that may have been the clincher. Right here. George on the takeaway. In flight, gets bumped and fouled. You get the sense the way this season has gone, they would like to come back with that group and give it another run. When Randy Whitman as the coach, he was entering his final year. Ernie. Of your top four bench guys. So what you're talking about here is five guys that make a major contribution to what you've accomplished. Foul call on Harrington outside with 47 points. Sunday and Tuesday to get going before the scene shifts the following weekend to Miami for games three and four. All right, so here are... And then all of a sudden you make a trade and you get Turner. So now you supposedly have...